I'm Derek Laginus, Services Solutions Engineer with McNaughton McKay Electric Company. In this video, I'll be showing you how to navigate through the My Rockwell Automation Customer Portal. Today, I'm going to walk you through the My Rockwell Automation Customer Portal. This page was created to provide a better customer experience, allowing you to navigate across your Rockwell Automation website. Let's get started with the digital business journey. Open your web browser and type in Rockwell Automation forward slash My. Then you will come into a sign-in page. In the email, you can enter your email, password, and you click on sign in. If you do not have a knowledge base account, please click on the create an account now. You are now at the My Rockwell Automation customer portal landing page. It has three major functions, search, manage, and browse. It also has shortcuts along the top that we can utilize later. All right, let's begin from the left side of the page, moving to the right. Beginning with Rockwell Automation, you're able to view Rockwell Automation events calendar, explore the Allen Bradley products, get support using the knowledge base, read the latest Rockwell Automation blog, and view products and services spotlighted by Rockwell Automation. The next link will be Allen Bradley. The Allen Bradley shortcut is a direct link to ab.com, where most people go to get their information. Now it's just one quick away in this portal. Moving on to Rockwell Software, this shortcut helps you learn more about Rockwell Automation software products and get the latest news regarding software updates. Moving on to the search function, you can enter a part number or catalog number to explore the improved search capabilities to learn more details about Allen Bradley products. In the future, Rockwell Automation will be adding replacement recommendations for discontinued parts. Let's go ahead and do a search. I've chosen to do the 1756 EN2TRXT controller. Go ahead and hit enter. And now you're able to add this controller to a bill of material, configure it, get real-time lifecycle status. You have quick links for the product family page, user manual, installation guide, and specifications. If you want to return back to the main page or the main landing page, you can click on My Rockwell Automation. Now we're right back here at the beginning. Let's continue on to Manage. You now have a list of digital tools here to help simplify your task or project that you're working on. Let's begin with My Bill of Material. You can create a new one or view previously created BOMs. The My Apps is the Rockwell Automation App Store. You're able to add useful apps to your PC, tablet, or mobile phone, and also view apps you've already installed. Moving on to My Repair, you can submit a new repair request online, add photos of your failed product, and track the progress of every repair you submit through view orders. Move on to My Account, where you can edit your profile, or go ahead and access your uh, authorization number, company address, or your current roles. My Equipment, this is a service that helps you gain thoughtful insight about the products that are installed in your plant through interactive visual aids developing and supporting your strategic maintenance plan. This begins with an installed base evaluation service. My Services, Here's where it allows you to view your current contracts. For example, if you have a TechConnect support agreement, software that you've purchased, or even a parts management agreement, you're able to view it there. Moving on to my recent activities, here's where you're able to see any recent activity on this particular customer portal. Let's go up to Browse. Browse provides you a list of digital libraries that you can easily access with one click, product services, software downloads, repair services, and digital tools. There's a few of them there to help you with events or training, just one click away. And now up in the right corner with a lightning bolt, click on that, that'll give you your notification center. Moving to the right of that, the three lines, will give you a whole list of Additional quick links, some of them are familiar. Uh, the welcome next to your name brings you to your ability to edit your profile, 
Home will bring you back to the original landing page. You should be familiar with my bill of materials, my apps, my repairs, my account, my equipment, and my service. And the product registration gives you the ability to enter a, a part or a piece of software that you'd like to register to you and your company. My recent activities shows you what you recently looked at and my contacts will immediately show you your local distributor. There's quick links to the knowledge base, literature library, product compatibility and download center. You have to go to the Rockwell Automation App Store, sales and partners, that's where you'll find local Rockwell sales offices, your local distributor, and other system integrators and OEMs that you have access to to work with projects on. You have news and events for upcoming events, tech ed, automation fair, other things like that. My help center, you're able to get additional information regarding some of the digital tools in the help center. And then you could sign out if need be. For additional questions or more videos like this, please give us a call or visit our website.